I'm going to um, show you some more on the mermaid tails. When I made the, I'll, I'll put a DIY on my mermaid tails I did a year ago, and I'm going to show you improvements on it. Now the kids didn't like the cotton in the middle because they didn't like their feet touching it, so I'm going to put a liner, then cut the cotton out. I'm going to show you how to cut out the mermaid tails. I already did a video on this, but I want to do something a little bit different. I'm going, this is the, you just get a, a top, and then you've got your bottoms. And what you do is you cut one of the legs off. You start at the crotch and cut up to the elastic. Take the leg you cut off. And I just kind of drew a tail here. It out. These are the fins. Let's cut this little ruffle off here. Gonna make a matching Barbie doll fin. If you want to do a matching Barbie doll, you can cut the sleeves off. Let's cut these sleeves. And then we're going to sew the ruffle back on here. So cut the ruffle off. And we're going to sew those back on to the sleeve. Okay. And then for the Barbie doll, I'll fold it. together so they don't get lost and this is going to go on the Barbie doll tail now since this is the front of the tail I'm going to cut up here so they can walk in it in my other video I had this closed and they had to hop around I'm going to install a zipper in there so I'll show you how that is done just cut right up here on the seam. About halfway up. Then we're going to sew the fin on there. And when they want it closed, then they can close it or just keep it open so they can walk. Okay, and I'll show you how to sew that up. I'm going to cut two of these out of the liner. tail stiff. There we go. You've got the cotton for the fins of the mermaid. Let's sew the mermaid tails and um, let's see how easy it is, okay? So look at that. I'll take the front part. Gonna surge a little bit of it. I want to put that elastic in. Grab a piece of elastic. Surge that on, and as you surge, you pull a little bit. Okay. Let's go back where we were. 
get all our pieces together. Then you grab that thread and bring that around. And that seals that waist. Just kind of try and get it turned inside out. Barbie doll with the tail on. Let's see how so around. Turn it inside out. Barbie doll. She's velcroed in the back. There's the doll with the top. And here's the dolly. And here's the tails. Cute. For the fin, you're going to have the material, the cotton, the liner, liner, and material. And get those all lined up. And then we're just going to surge around them. So you got all your layers. Smooth them out. These kids want to put their feet in here, so you want to use sew up not much space. Well, there's your fins. We're going to sew where their feet go. So just surge around there. Okay, now there's your fins. Now you grab the pants. Let's sew up the hole in the back that we put there. Based, we're going to start right up here. So I've got a pink zipper here. Now, you want it a nice long one, 22 inch or whatever. The balloon was too short. Anyway, so we want the zipper, we want it to open down at the bottom. So, let's just sew that zipper on there. Now, let's just sew it on there. We'll go ahead and close that zipper up. get past here. Okay. Now the let's go back down this way. And so the other side of the zipper on here. I came up, I haven't finished sewing yet. I wanted to move this zipper head out of the way. So let's sew the rest of this down here. So right off the edge there. Let's see how that looks. And there's your zipper. Now, we're going to sew the tail to here. But, so you find the middle of the tail and it's just going to go right here. Take a look at that and see how that tail just sits there. And then when it zips up, this part is open because that's where they want to put their feet. And there's your mermaid tail and your matching Barbie. You've got to sew the Velcro on the back here. I'll do that. And we just have the sleeve that we cut. We're just going to serge that closed. Okay, let's hem this. This one didn't have a ruffle, but that's all right. Take the sleeve, tuck it inside. 
how you want that to be. Then you just turn it inside out. Just stitch right along there. And that seals everything right in. See right there. There's the raw edge and the folded. And you just sew right along there. And then when you unfold it, you've got your sleeve all sewed up. And that's how the finished hem looks. And you've got it all sealed in. It's not going to fray because you've got the, the hem there. Okay, that's called a blind hem and it looks professional. Cute. That's the top. Barbie doll. And may tell. Now we just got to test it out on somebody. Now this Barbie doll, um, it covers all the way to the top. So all we need to do here is put something around her waist. See how that is? That makes it really cute. Now this is with the mermaid tail zipped up and the fins are in the back. And let's see you walk. <laughs> A little hard. Okay, come back. Okay, and if she wants to walk, and we unzip it. Okay, unzip it. Okay, now walk. A little easier to walk. Okay, come back. <laughs> Let's see. Okay, now zip it. Then you become a real mermaid when you zip it. There you go. She did it herself. Okay, now walk. Oh, you got to see your matching Barbie. Thank you. I hope you like that DIY and um, that the kids will love it. And it doesn't all you it doesn't cost anything because all you do is just get jammies. You um, cut them up and make them into mermaid tails, and the kids will even love sleeping in them. And I've improved them so that they can put their feet in there and they can unzip it if it gets, so they can walk around. They don't have to hop unless they want to hop. But thank you and good night. I hope you enjoyed it. I sure hope you subscribe. These are really cute. I just love my matching mermaid tails. Love mermaids. <laughs>